Father, where are we going? Oh. Father, can we? I... I want to go hunting. I will follow. We are with you, Atreus. What do we hunt? Beer. Which way we headed, lad? In... the direction of deer. Do you wish to speak of what happened? I think I heard something. This way. He just needs space. Changes us. You are not weak to feel its effects. We're all feeling its effects. <laughs> We're heading the right way. There's broken branches over there. Come on. I keep seeing it. The knife, rock, Sentry's face. Son. There it is.
Elbow up. Accuracy over speed. Why? That was running. And so are we. I don't understand. When an animal is wounded, it must stop the bleeding, or it will die. We have been wounded in this. This is a distraction. My fault. No. No. You should find Sindri. I have a pretty good idea where he might be. Is it okay if we take the sleds? I need to think about what I'm gonna say to him. Of course. Everywhere I look, I'm reminded of my mistakes. Our actions have consequences. To be reminded of them is not punishment. Feels like it. If I had just... Seen through a deception that fooled us all. Stopped an attack you could not predict. There is no if, Atreus. Your father's right. There are things even gods cannot control. Swana. It's Becky. Here's Temple. That's where we're headed. Mimir, is there a chance that we could bring Brock back? Sentry did it once. Maybe we could figure out a way to do it again. I'm afraid not, little brother. When a soul missing its full gear, its direction, like Brock, leaves its corporeal form. Well, it can't reach the Lake of Souls. He's not only dead, he's been denied an afterlife. There's nothing to bring back. It's really gone. Atreus, if there was anything we could do, I promise you, we'd be doing it. I know. It was stupid of me to help in the first place.
I miss when the lake was still water. I feel like I want to get on a boat and just sail away from here. From everything. You cannot sail away from your mistakes. It is impossible to forget them. Aye. They'll follow you no matter where you go, little brother. If you are to sail, do it toward somewhere. The lift at the end of the bridge, it still work. We can get up to the temple that way. Brother, we really should stay on course. Yes. What makes you so sure Sindri will be here? It's where he and Brock reunited. Reforging something that broke. He'll be here. Sindri, I... I'm so sorry. No. I... No, I don't want to hear it. You don't know what sorry means. We're not letting Odin get away with this. Could that be the Odin you invited into my home? We were all fooled. Oh. But some of us were bigger fools than others, aren't we? I gave you everything. My skills. My friendship. My home. My secrets. My treasures. And you just kept taking. And now what have I got? Not even my family. You want sorry? This is what sorry looks like. I... What can we do? We... There is no we. There's only you. No matter what the cost. So what you can do... Is get the fuck out of my sight! Come with us. family too. feel better when we brought Odin to justice. Justice? Justice is not what we seek. It is vengeance. Every path leads back to vengeance. Maybe that's all we have left. We must return to Freya. Hmm. 
when we get back, we're, we really are going to war. It has come to that. Yes. back in Svartalfheim, looking for Tyr. This isn't what I wanted. This wasn't what I meant. Not if it meant losing Brock. We know Atreus. We know. You really took everything from Sindri? Don't take to heart what said in grief, Atreus. No matter how spot on they feel. see Freya, but I wouldn't mind staying here in Midgard for a little while. Aye, a few last adventures to take our minds off the state of, well, everything. Even sure Freya will still be at the house. Don't see why not. Odin's back door in was also his way out. Without the blasted raven apparently hiding in the broom closet, the house should be secure. And she will not turn away allies in her vengeance. Aye, it's all our vengeance now. And no more fake Tear to twist our minds around. Oh, what a mockery he made of Tear's desire for peace and mine. back are you with us mm. good it's time time for what did i ask time to unite the realms against odin once and for all tear tried to unite the realms the real tear everyone loved him and even he failed then we better not fail or there will be no one left to try this is ragnarok and odin's already heard every blasted plan we have yes we've lost the element of surprise more than that we have only one way to asgard and it's not subtle go on 
It means we enter from Tyr's temple, here. Asgard's wall is here. Odin's host of Einherjar will hold the space in between. Which means we need armies of our own. As many as will answer the call. Numbers Odin won't see coming. And that's just to reach the wall. To breach the wall, we'll need to find Sartar. Radatoskar was able to procure this. The three of us will go. I know just where to look. Mm. Splendid. Allies, then. Who do we think we can get? I'll venture to Helheim. Try to recruit the army of the dead. And I'll return to Alfheim to unite the elves. But just like that. Unite the elves after centuries of war. Well, they really like me in Alfheim. And you? To that I'm... Yes. To find Sigrun and muster the free Valkyries. Midgard has no army. No Niflheim, no Jotunheim. That leaves only Svartalfheim. I'll go to Svartalfheim. Sindri? Are you sure? I said I'll go. <sighs> so be it. Good luck to us all. to Muspelheim to find the last fire giant. I almost envy everyone else's impossible mission. I was in this behind with Thor. Thor. Don't worry. You didn't see me go in. That was not my worry. Now look. When we find Surtur. Like, tomorrow. Goodbye. Yeah. When the two of them, uh, join, they'll create an enormous Asgard-destroying monster. Oh, my. I have some doubts regarding negotiations with Rasvelger in Helheim. My thinking is that she may be more amenable to speaking with a member of the, uh, deceased. Mimir, you're needed. Oh, death is a skill now. I suppose these two can survive a bit without me. Brother, if you wouldn't mind. Very well. Many thanks. We'll catch up with you later. Hey. I think I can see Surtur's forge in the distance. Surtur's wife. Where is she? Nikolai. Thank you. Outcome. We head down towards that tower. We might be able to see the forge. I wonder if they saw their prophecy and decided to isolate themselves in their home realms to fight it. Understandable. Hopefully they'll understand why Ragnarok needs to happen now. Hey, that's the other half of the broken moose behind seed we found. We can take it to a mystic gateway. Maybe we'll find Sutter's combat trial. Look, over there. Ah! <laughs> 
Lava fall. You know this. When I was here before, I saw something that looked like a forge anyway. We need to be ready for Surtur, in case he doesn't want to help us. Ready? Prophecy says he and Sinmara join. But who knows how they're gonna feel about it now. You would try to force these primordial beings into submission? Well, I don't know. We can't win this war without them, right? We gotta be close. I can hear the force. Him. We will ask. <laughs> Hello, Sarger? Well, either it isn't him or he's ignoring us. Come on. Hello. We seek a fire giant. Go away. Oh! Oh! What just happened? Hey, that wasn't. We deal with these fuck. 
won't help you. Who are you? Who you seek. And what's left on him. Why won't you help us? I don't... want to. Elaborate. We'll die. Right. Because you've got so much to live for. Not me. Her. So what's the point of all this? You keep separate from Sinmara just so you can sit here and wait to die? At least if you joined with her, you'd be together again. We are together. Not her heart. She's got mine. It's not much, but it's enough. But you're not even... Have you ever been in love? It's pretty good. And Odin will succeed. And all realms save Asgard will fall. Yeah, he must die. It's true. But I won't sacrifice her any more than you would him. Sorry. Come. Wait. Those blades. May I see them? Put those in here. 
and I'll become your monster. But I don't want her involved at all. But the prophecy says you two have to combine. Sure this will work? What have I got to live for? Not here. Follow me. where Niflheim and Muspelheim meet. Where the first realms came into existence. You won't be able to get through this, huh? Whoa. Uh, Serger? Still, Still me. me. Better than walking. What awaits us at this spark of the world? Magic, primordial stuff. With that and your blades and my heart, we'll be good. I'll get you big, smash stuff. You'll like it. But what'll happen when you change? Don't know. Won't be me anymore. But how will you, or um, future new you, no one to attack Asgard. You got the horn. Right? Yeah. Then we're good. So, here it is. The spark of the world. This is beautiful. I'll meet you across. This feels too easy. Odin knows we have Gallo on. He knows you have the mask. After killing Brock, he knows we would seek Surtur to start this war. But what other choice do we have? None. He knows that, too. This is it. What about Sinmara? Should we at least tell her? No. It had hurt her too much. More than not knowing what happened to you? Sometimes, loving someone is about choosing the lesser pain. That doesn't make any sense. I promise you'll stay away from her. You have our word. Sorter, is stabbing you with the blades gonna be enough to create this new you? Simar's heart is cold. Dad's now got my fire in those blades. If enough of me and the sparks fire go into enough of her, it should work. Okay. Come here.
find them, you get Ragnarok. It's time.
attack Asgard? I await the call. Uh, great! Hear that? All we have to do is call him with Gellerhorn when we're ready. Let's head back to Moose Farm. We can take the Mystic Gateway back from there. Believe it. We got Ragnarok on our side. Sorter's plan just worked. I mean, the Valkyries were a small setback, but I bet we've got Odin worried now. He knows we're coming for him. <laughs> Think about it. We're gonna show up to Asgard, and Ragnarok's gonna come in and wreck everything. Odin won't stand a chance. We're gonna win. Kro was right. Groa failed to predict what we would sacrifice in return. Maybe she could only see the big stuff. This is gonna work, right? It must. Ragnarok's strength grows. Hey, check out that cliff. Earthquake must have shook this place up enough to make a ledge. More of Odin's forces! Trying to finish the job is not where he started! On your left! Lightning! It's coming! Nice! Take it hard! Do not worry about me! that cliff. Earthquake must have shipped this place up enough to make a ledge. More of Odin's forces. He's trying to finish the job is not where he started. Hey, check out that cliff. Earthquake must have shook this place up enough to make a ledge. Ah! More of Odin's forces. He's trying to finish the job after he started. Help 
that cliff. Earthquake must have shook this place up enough to make a ledge. Ah! Uh, more of Odin's forces. Uh, I can finish the job if Valkyrie started. Father, we can climb back towards the gate. <laughs> so, you fought in a lot of wars, right? You've never had anything like Ragnarok on your side? I have. And the creature does not guarantee our victory. Right. Place is gonna fall apart if those keep happening. soon. We need to get back. You're quiet. I mean, you're always quiet, but this feels different. I had hoped my days of ceaseless battles were over. I had hoped to never see my son go to war. Yeah! yeah. 
guys just don't give up. Ragnarok is here. They know what that means for Asgard. The rider keeps healing it. <laughs> We're doing the right thing. Ragnarok has to happen. The price we and others paid for this war is high. It will only get higher. It'll be worth it. And yes, my usefulness to a certain Vanir Numpty did run out. Ragnarok awaits our call. As do the armies of hell. Thanks mostly to me. It seems war is upon us at last. Where to now, brother? We've some time before we're expected at the temple. This could be our last chance, father. Is there anything you want to finish up? do you know of the mask? Only that it was the great passion of Odin's life. He journeyed across Adia's burning ocean into the heart of the silent matron herself to find it. Lost every man in his crew, but to hear him tell it, it was worth all that blood and more. <laughs> feeling you might pop in here. You know everybody's meeting in Midgard, right? I knew he'd left something behind. Time to cleave some hands. Now those are some angry knives. to make Odin's spear look like a toothpick. And a little one. Thanks for this. 
Thanks for this. Mm, know what you want? Woohoo! Looking good! It fits. This is it then, the beginning of the end. The end for Odin, and after that, a new beginning for the rest of us. That's right. I know, I'm just looking forward to seeing all the realms finally standing up to him. Elves and dwarves and hell itself. You are so certain they will unite? They have to, after everything they've been through. They have to, don't they? Anything in Midgard you want to do? You know, while we still can. Freya and the others are still making preparations <laughs> for the attack. So there's time. About the oracles of your lands, would you say they manipulated events? Did they have an agenda? I do not doubt they held their own interests first, but in my experience, they could be easily fooled by their well, the own armies. Obstacle. Probably gathered in their home realm, waiting for when we blow Galarum. Yes, I was kind of hoping to see some of them here. When all the realm towers open at once, we'll see plenty, lad. Odin won't believe what's coming for him. No. Odin had lifetimes to prepare for this. Whatever grows deception, he heard the truth as tear. Do not underestimate him. Rousing speech, brother. Very inspirational. Wow. The Valkyries look different. Welcome back. Hildesfini informed me of your success. We've been planning accordingly. Well, what would Ragnarok be without Ragnarok? Who else agreed to join us? I see the Valkyries. Better than that. They are reborn. Corporeal and uncorrupted, thanks to no small amount of Vanir magic. They're shield maidens now. Nice. And your brother? He came through. 
The elves called a truce to unite against Asgard. That gives us an advantage by air, and with Hell's army for a vanguard. What about Sindri? Will the dwarves fight? We haven't heard from him. But there's time yet. And I think we have what we need to clear a path for the Ragnarok beast. Well, when you say it like that, why worry at all? It's good to see you so... alive. Oh, yes. I wasn't myself when last we met. I'm glad you're safe. My queen, the shield maidens will be divided among the forces breaching from Alfheim, Helheim, and here in Midgard. We stand ready. Kratos, Atreus, Amir, please excuse me. Oh. Good night, then. Freya, have you determined our path out of Asgard? If the towers are the way in, we count on them being the way out. And if they are not? Then we all know what we signed up for. Our plan is only missing one thing. A leader. That honor is yours. You have a righteous claim. And the respect of your troops. And you have faced this enemy before. I held his invading army to a stalemate. This is our invasion, a siege on his terrain. I want our most experienced wartime general in the field. I don't care about the honors, I don't care about the prophecies and champions. I just need us to win. Freya. I know what I'm asking. Just... sleep on it? Here we are. Kratos, your tent is to the right, and Atreus, yours is to the left. Mine? A young warrior needs his own space, don't you think? I do. Wow. Thanks. Sleep on what we spoke of. Let me know in the morning what you decide. Excuse me. May I have a moment with Mimir? I don't know what tomorrow brings, but if tonight is our last night, I'd like to spend it feeling something besides hate. Will you tell me one last silly story? There's nothing I'd like more, except perhaps a dance. Yet do I may have lost a step. Do you respect love? I don't tell silly stories. You only tell silly stories. <laughs> I could never argue with you. Can I sleep here tonight?
You must quiet your mind. I can't. story. If I fall asleep, promise you'll finish it tomorrow? Of course. Now, close your eyes. an old man who chopped wood for his village. Every evening he bore the logs on his back and delivered them to his people. But the logs were heavy and he grew weaker as time went. And one day he threw down the logs as he could no longer bear their weight. And he, he called for death to come to him. And when death arrived, He's the only one who ever got my highbrow sense of humor. Damn fine woman she was. Apart from her taste in men, of course. She was a special woman. She wanted to protect people. She was here. She saw every step we took before we took it. Like she was always with us. Watching over us. Leading us home? Does my request upset you? Death is a natural part of life, my love. I wish only to be prepared for when my time comes. We mortals must do such things. I am glad to have you prepare with me. You are quiet? I have nothing to say. Well, say something. I enjoy hearing your voice. 
a funeral pyre. I would have chosen different. Oh? You would have me trapped in the ground for eternity. I would have you close to me. How touching. My rotting corpse would bring you such comfort. Mm. You once tried to take charge of your ending, did you know? That was different. Circumstance, yes. But not on purpose. <laughs> you prepare for a distant future. There is much time ahead of us. I wish to better a future that will exist without me whenever that day comes for you and for our son. We will always walk together, Kratos. You will always be a part of me. I will always be a part of you. And when you are gone, that part of me dies as well. You feel your absence? No. Culmination of love is grief. And yet we love, despite the inevitable. We open our hearts to it. When the pyre is spent, and you have gathered my ashes, spread them from the highest peak in all the realms. You will do this for me. is to have loved fully. Open your heart to the world as you have opened it to me and you will find every reason to keep living in it. I'll meet you outside, Father. Sir.
hope to fly into battle with you one more time, my queen. Me too. But not as your queen. As sisters. Are you ready? Yes. I will be your general. It will be an honor to fight alongside you, General. Aye, brother. I'll be right by your side. So, what are your orders? To the temple. General. Sir? General? General? Sir. Hey, bud. Uh, General. Prophecy did not lead us here, nor will it win this battle. Wars are won by those that are willing to sacrifice everything. If that is the cost of vengeance, so be it. Odin has taken so much from us already. The realms have suffered. Enough! No matter the cost. This ends... today. If going out in a blaze of glory means that Odin burns too? That's where I'll be. A big, fat smile on my face. For Brock. After Niflheim next. They're trying to shut out Ragnarok. You gotta stop those war machines. Not an ideal start. Wait. 
We don't have time. I know. Just wait. Got work to do. You three, follow them. Trance. Freya, with me. Watch our flanks. To the war machines. This way! Behind you! Behind you! 
Giants made it after all. The snake looks different. He is different. But when I was away, uh, uh, never mind, later. The Ain Heryar's link to Valhalla. My sisters and I must sever it. Go. Still no sign of the dwarves. Sindri won't let us down. We have to trust him. Hmm. Rally all you can. We will make for this funnel of Huntawa. <laughs> The war machines. Oh, so we're pretty desperate, huh? <laughs>
we found them through the round day. Good friend. She She'll be fine. We got more important things to worry about. Even if we can breach the wall. Perhaps it is better this way. Better for who? Dwarves are dying for this! Sid, we... Save it! Oh, the force them to build those war machines! And I'm here to tear them down! Before you break them, we must turn them on the floor. Fine! Leave it to the dwarves to clean up after the giants! <laughs> Careful, Bella. You're covered in bypass. By the bloody time he showed up. what you wanted I, I didn't want this no close your heart to it close your heart who are they my guardians Odin took them in they shouldn't be here they're not soldiers Odin put them in our path to die. It's war. Wars are won. By those who are willing to sacrifice... ...everything. What are you doing? Size of that thing? I think we're gonna win. I mean, if they don't kill us first. Why have you stopped? Ragnarok is here. We finally have Odin right where we. We will stop Odin. But we did not come to sacrifice the innocent. We will breach the wall at Rimthor's flaw. With what army? Atreus and I will be enough. That's suicide. It may be. But we will die seeking justice, not vengeance. 
Can that weapon break open the flaw? Only one way to find out. You three. Get those people to safety wherever you can find it. We will see it done. Frey and I will do what we can to slow Ragnarok. He was not mindless before. See if he will listen to reason. <laughs> Odin will not get away. If he does, so help me. I know. Valky! No! No! Protect him! I will help those that are trapped. And meet you at the fall. Go! Go, Atreus! Sentry! Be careful and stay behind me! You be careful. I'm here to fight. Did I just say? No, you can't. Shut up and fight. Thank you. No, I just want. I don't care what you want. This changes nothing. You really had me believing you that we didn't have to be enemies. Dude, you're okay. My mom was right about you all along. You're a killer just like your father, and you're here to kill us all. No, just Odin. Sentry, go! She's a friend. Friends don't bring the end of the world to each other's doorstep, Loki! You're right. You're right. I, I, I made some bad decisions. You do that a lot. I'm not sure that's a defense. It's not a defense. I just want to make it right. I, is Skilder okay? Have, have you seen him? Why wouldn't he be? What are you talking about? Odin is willing to sacrifice the Midgardians. He put them along the wall to try and deter us. Knowing they can't fight, their deaths are just meant to slow us down. Why would he do that? And how am I supposed to believe you? Because he's right. It's who Odin is. It's who he's always been. Mom, why are you here? What? He'll sacrifice anyone at a problem with one of him. The Guardians. Your friend, our family, any of us. I had hoped that your father would stand up to him, but now it, it has to be you. Mom, what are you saying? Thrud. 
I never doubted that you would make the finest Valkyrie these realms have ever seen. But not for him. Do you understand? That our family... Without Odin, we can be one again. A real one. What he's doing is wrong. He said if we held our ground, we'd be safe. He said we owed him. You don't owe him your death. <laughs> no shit. Dad will never let them get their grandfather. Then go with him. He'll listen to you. Are you ready to go find the rest of your people? Yeah. I love you, Mom. I love you, too. Finally.
Great launch. That's where we gotta go. Yeah. Hit it, Marlos. That may not be our biggest problem right now. Throw the danger! Get back to your sister. You must hold back, Ragnarok. This fight is mine. But if I could just take Atreus in the mask and do not look back. My son trusts you, so I trust you. Get away from her! Dad, wait! I am done with you and your son! No more fucking games! And this time, I'm allowed to kill you. We do not need to do this! We do! It's what we are! I can take And you! The light seems to think you're free! Move it and stop them! Talking gold! Wait and die! Then it's up! Won't be enough! Stay in control of it, brother! I know! Go! 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 You're what the old father made you! You can choose it! You are! Go and think for yourself, my lord! You're firmly full of Enough! Like you know. You attack my daughter! No! I did not You bring this to my home! My family! Die! Run! Run! 
Try to hurt her! I would not. Don't you know... ...what I've done? Yes! But what will you do now? We don't change. We are destroyers. No more. No more. For the sake of our children, we must be better.
Why isn't he dead? Are you talking? Who told you to do that? You don't talk. You don't think. I think you kill. It's a simple fucking concept. Sif was right about you. I just didn't want to see it. What is this? Are you broken? I am your father. Take the hammer and kill who I tell you to kill. I did not want this. No! Dude, this was all their fault. They've done this to us, to our family. Looks like I gotta do everything around here. Your own son? You granddaughter! Why? We're gonna be fine. I saved her. That one's on you. You turned them against me. You turned them all against me. this everything you hoped for? Was your plan really all that much better than mine? I hope you got exactly what you want. Oh, oh. What? Not quite yet. <laughs> Think you're the only one who can craft a binding spell? I spent many long winters thinking about what I would say to you as I watched you take your last breath. But now, I realize there's only one thing I need you to know. You have no hold on me anymore! And that's my friend. I forgot how good you look with wings. <laughs> oh, husband. You always sought knowledge well. Now I'm going to teach you what it's like to lose everything. <laughs> Bow to your queen. I always loved you. You know... You've never loved anyone! No
Father? Freya? You did it, Loki. No, 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 <laughs> no more fighting. No, none of that matters now. This is your moment, Loki. Roa tried to hide you from me, but this is your destiny. Champion of the Jotnar. Only he can put on a mask. Only he can gaze into the truth of creation. Unfold the secrets of life and death. No more doubt, no more confusion. You were born for this. Put on the mask. Loki, ask it, ask it the question. This is your choice, son. I trust you. to be nothing! So Attack! Me. You've waited a long time for this, haven't you, Frig? So have I! Too late for that! chance, Loki. I could have had my answers. I could have learned the truth. You took that away from me. I could have made things better. We could have made the Nine Realms better. This was never about the realms or me. It was about you. You destroyed everything. My home, my family, my kingdom. You did those things. Your choices. You killed your own son. It wasn't my choice. I had no choice. There's always a choice. You have to stop. 
You can choose to be better. No, I can't. I have to know what happens next. I will never stop. Why'd you have to say that? Sofna, Akfra, Desu. Sofna, Hithan. Sofna. Sofna. I swore I would never rob from you the choice between life and death. I have waited so long for this moment. And now that I'm here, I don't need this to make me whole. We stopped his madness. That's all that matters. supposed to be. Huh? There he is. Wake up, Atreus. Wake up. Glad you've come back to us. Uh, hi. Where, where is my father? Somewhere here in the Holt. He'll be glad to see you. Thanks, Herr.
Mom, stop it. I'm fine. Hush. It's rude. Loki! I'm so glad you're both alive. You have no idea, and... I'm sorry. Thor. He was... He tried, you know? I'm sorry, I couldn't do more. Nothing will fix what you're feeling. But I hope there's some comfort in knowing Odin's gone. There absolutely is. Loki, it was an honor to fight alongside a giant. Know that. Will you stay here in Midgard? For a bit? Then I've got something I need to find. I'm working with Hildesvini to get the rest of the Asgardians to Vanaheim. To help rebuild. Then I hope it can be a fresh start for them. And you. Oh, and through. I hope you find what you're looking for. Good luck. See ya, Loki. Take care. Lugan made it out. Good for him. Oh, and if you could get this wood over to Brana's tent, it? she... Loki! Hey! Glad to see the head injury didn't make you forget me. Did you have a head injury? Everything was a blur. Maybe that was someone else. Anyway, man, I I'm just... I'm really glad to see you. I'm glad to see you, too. Looks like you're keeping busy. Yeah, go find your dad. You've been apart long enough. See ya. Oh, there he is. And one for the kid, too. Skull! Here, here. Skull, we wouldn't be here if it weren't for you. And for your sacrifice. It's true. Well, we were just swapping our own Freyer fables. Right, right. So where was I? Oh, when we met, I was expecting this warrior, this master planner, a born leader. The legend came before the man. But the man himself was very different. He won me over, though. He was just so damn kind. I think it helped that he was handsome. This is true. And incredibly charming. All right, stop. Y'all are going to start crying all over again. Sorry. Gotta go find my father. What do you say, you? I'm pleased to see you awake. Freya. It was his choice. I couldn't take that from him. He saved us all. I'll never forget that. The family I thought I had was taken from me piece by piece. But there's comfort in the family I've chosen. Your mother was right, you know. You grew into that bow after all. You are a formidable warrior. But even more than that, you have a good heart. Nothing you've endured has changed that. I'm so proud of the man you've become, Atreus. Thank you. For everything. I should find my father. You should. I appreciate the concern, but I wish to be alone right now.
Atreus! Oh, you gave us quite a scare there. Glad to see you too, Mimir. Listen, I want to thank you. Oh, what else did you expect from the smartest man alive? It's not just because you're smart. You listened to me, mentored me, and, well, you're basically another dad to me. What? No. I need you to hear it. I appreciate you so much. Huh. I love you too, little brother. See you, Mimir. It's good to see you about, Atreus. You too, Hildesvini. You did so good today, boy. I'm so proud of you. <clears throat> Maybe later, we can find some treats. Okay. My turn. Who's that, huh? Yeah, we know him. <laughs> Maybe one of these days I'll surprise you. Oh? You already have. saving us. I decided it would be better if I wrote the ending myself. You haven't told your father yet, have you? I told him about what? Come on. Giant visions. I already saw it. I get it. Every part of me is telling me this is what I have to do. I... I just... don't know how to say it. Come with me. I've got something I want to show you. Both of you. This is for you too. Mm. Oh. Atreus, I am glad you are well. I'm glad you are too. So, what was the end of the story? Before Ragnarok, you promised to finish it if I fell asleep. Hmm. When death arrived, he asked why the old man had called for him. Seeing death before him caused the old man to reconsider his request. After a moment, he asked that death help him lift the logs onto his back so that he may continue on his journey. He wasn't ready to die. He wished to keep living. There's a lot of smoke out there. Hmm. It seems when Asgard fell, pieces of it landed all over the realms. There might still be some Einherjar near them, but that's not what I brought you here to see.
mother. My shrine in Jotunheim. She destroyed it. She didn't want us to know our fate. We forged our own path because of her. She went against her own people. Our people. To protect you. They don't all open. I'm sorry. Father, I... I need to talk to you about something. There are other giants out there. And I've got to find them. I think I know where to look, but... They're my responsibility. I need to do this alone. I, I don't want to do it alone, but... I need to. It's hard to explain. Does it frighten you? Yeah. That is why you must do it. Like you taught me. Yeah. We survive today because of your choices. Who to trust. Who to call friend. You are ready. Remember our promise. Loki will go. Atreus. Atreus remains.
did you see in there, brother? Well... One I had never imagined. And what now? to it. Ah, uh, Flair. We should probably talk about Gana. We don't need to talk about her. We just need to find her. But Odin chose her as his new Valkyrie queen. A Vanir goddess. Your friend. Gana pledged loyalty to Asgard long ago, and our friendship ended soon after. What happened? I made a choice. One she couldn't accept. Kratos. She hates me. She will be a problem for us. Better we find her than she finds us? And another one for the big boy himself! Skull! Skull! Skull. few dozen per cap. Families will stay together, obviously. Take care, Kratos. Thank you. I appreciate that. And we'll bring all the supplies we can, although it won't be much. 
Don't worry about it. Anyone who's able can head out for extra supplies. Aesir and Vanir. Together. General, Lady Freya, Mimir, my lady. Shield maidens. Blessed the war. Have you found the traitor Gana yet, dear Freya? Not yet. Soon. Where to first? We could take care of any lingering business in the realms. Or investigate those pieces of Asgard. Either way, we are with you, brother. <laughs> Linda also mentioned there's going to be a get-together to honor Brock's memory at Rab's tavern in Svartalfine. I'd like to go. Freya, something is on your mind. What is it? Freya stole it. I'm glad he got it back. Odin stole it? Not quite. It couldn't be stolen. It had to be given freely. Freya had it forged in his younger days, imbued with its own motives and passion. For centuries, he swore he would only ever set it down in death or upon meeting the love of his life. Both he and the sword were romantics, you see. 